Hey guys, it's the Soul Clock here, and today in Silo is a Monster Legends analysis video. We're going to be going over Flamguard, and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he's worth getting out of his race. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Flamguard is a tank slash attacker, and his traits are going to be Hardened, Control Immunity, and then a Megaton, which is an amazing trait. All three of those are pretty great, especially rank 1 and 3. Rank 3 is definitely his best, and then rank 1 is amazing as well. So yeah, definitely get this monster to rank 3 if you are going to be using him because he does kind of need Megaton to be a good tank. And then if we go on down to his pros and cons, his great supporting effects and 50% shield, skill mirror, damage boost, and Megaton. He has a pretty good damage output for a tank. He also has access to two tortures in bleed and ignite. He also has a great trait. And then his cons are no self-sustain besides the 50% shield, which can be blocked by positive effects block and nanovirus. So yeah, he doesn't have heals or anything like that. And then if we go on down to his moveset, he has a massive dark damage with bleed, which is really good. He also has a self-skill mirror with damage boost. He has a self-megaton with skill mirror. He also has a heavy fire damage with ignite. He has an AoE low dark damage with bleed. And then he has an AoE moderate fire damage with ignite. And then he has a moderate fire damage and a 50% shield and double damage. So yeah, this monster is definitely a tank slash attacker because you can boost his attack a bunch in order to do a ton of damage. But at the same time, he has a Megaton and he has Skill Mirror, which is definitely tank stuff. So yeah, this monster is pretty great. He has some pretty great moves and his traits are, of course, really good as well. Just make sure to get him to rank 3 if you were going to use him because that does make him like 10 times better with that Megaton. So yeah, try to get him to rank 3 if you're going to use him. And yeah, he has some pretty great moves right here. I would definitely go ahead and use that double damage one right here. The counter offensive with the 50% shield and double damage. And then definitely an AoE moderate fire damage with ignite probably. And then a massive dark damage with bleed would be pretty good. And then probably the Megaton with skill mirror as well. Yeah, those would be the four that I would use. But yeah, let me know down in the comments if you guys are going to end up getting this monster. Definitely try to find a good team by Friday in order to get him. Actually, this video will probably be coming out around then. Probably the day before. So make sure to find a good team by tomorrow in order to get this monster. And yeah, this is in the next one. Over to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.